Leave, supporters rallying in London, blaming me for uncertainty over Brexit Pro-Brexit supporters took to London Street Saturday for the UK Unity and Freedom March, demanding to focus on freedom from the EU, The Guardian reported. The demonstration was opposed by a rival rally, backed by the George Soros Back Group Best for Britain, which is calling for a second referendum. Thousands of people decided to take part in the UK Unity and Freedom March on Saturday, which marks two years since the historic Brexit referendum, The Guardian reported. Demonstrators were shouting, We do we want? Brexit. When do we want it? Now, whose country, our country, as well calling to free Tamia Robinson at the rally. Most of them hold banners, we want our country back, and, make Britain great again. Some of the speakers attending the rally have blamed the government, namely, Prime Minister Theresa May, for uncertainty over the Brexit, insisting that British people had made their choice during the referendum and this choice should be respected. As they explained, most of the current member of the UK government supports staying in the European Union, thus creating obstacles for the talks. The organisers focused on freedom from the EU, freedom from terror, freedom of speech, freedom from Sharia law and unity of all people irrespective of race or creed, as they have previously vowed. Some right-wing political figures attended the rally, such as UKIP leader Gerard Batten, members of the Pegida Group, as well as the English Defence League. The demonstration started in Victoria at 2 p.m. and headed to College Green, near Parliament Square, before proceeding all the way to the Eid celebration in Trafalgar Square. The march was taking place amid UK Foreign Secretary Boris Johnson's calls on British Prime Minister Theresa May to ensure a full British Brexit, following cabinet warnings that the UK could walk away from the talks with Brussels without a deal. Other negotiators prepared for a difficult scenario, thus, UK International Trade Secretary Liam Fox said the UK was not bluffing about being prepared to walk away from talks with Brussels and Brexit Secretary David Davis said there is lots going on to prepare in case negotiations collapse. The march was opposed by a rival demonstration, the People's Vote protest, organized by anti-Brexit groups based at Millbank Tower, led by Open Britain and supported by the George Soros-backed group Best for Britain, which is campaigning for a second referendum. The two demonstrations coincided, as the latter ended near the Eid celebration in Trafalgar Square. However, no clashes or damages have been reported.